and we are rolling what's up guys welcome to unlimited freedom this is vaughn with unlimited freedom today is march 13th 2023 and we are going to be you know getting into a little update about nova tech here we got a couple of different things going on that i want to address and so i am uh currently in my nova tech back office account so i'm going to go over the uh, new announcement we're going to crack into that a little bit and then i'm just going to give you kind of an overall update about uh, what is going on and the latest and greatest uh, here with Novatech. So that could be a uh, that could be a big win, or it might be a. All right, so we're just gonna have to uh, we're gonna have to look into it, guys. So first and foremost, let me read this new announcement that they uh, put out. This was uh, uh, actually it's not so new. This came out on the ninth, but I'm just now looking at it. Uh, but uh, nevertheless, I want to read it to you. Go over with you what it says. It says, dear member. In an effort to help address pending support requests, we have created and added a new support request form to the back office. L support. L Novatech support. L. They don't have any. They don't have any support. So, I mean, they could say that, okay, so they got a new request form, okay. But I've, I have never had a company ignore me, ignore my support requests, to the extent that Novatech has. Never in my life, okay? And I've dealt with some companies that were, you know, eh, you know, not exactly the most, uh, you, you know, the most professional in the world, but this one, in terms of support, man. That's an L. Okay, so if you have a pending request, right, we ask that you kindly resubmit your request again. Uh, via the new form provided in the support menu. Okay, so now, you know, once again, this is a new, uh, this is just a, to me, this is a new way for Novatech to say, hey, we're not going to respond to these requests, guys. Uh, but, you know, some of you might remember that before what they did was they came out and said, okay, um, well, you know, our request, uh, our request log is really backlogged. So we're, you know, and they just flat out said, we're not going to be able to get to all these requests. So we're, we're going to delete the whole cache. We're going to delete all of the requests. We're going to just delete them all. So if you really have a pressing issue, you're going to have to resubmit the request. Now, this is like 2.0 of where, you know, the excuse for why we're not answering our request tickets. And this one is saying, okay, so now now what we've done is we've com we created a new a new uh, support request ticket, and so therefore uh, all the other requests that are still pending, forget about it, man. Forget about it. You're, they, you're not gonna get an answer to those requests. Now you got to to resubmit it again. And uh, are you gonna get an answer to the new ones that you resubmit? I don't know, but the track record so far is showing that that's doubtful. Okay, and hey, look, listen, I'm going to call it like I see it, guys, okay? I'm not coming on here to hate on Novatech. I'm not coming on here to exalt over exalt Novatech either. We're going to say that the good is the good and the bad is the bad. And right now, we all know that Novatech's having some problems, okay? So instead of just ignoring it, why don't we come out and address it, talk about it, and see if we can get some uh, consensus on what's going on and hopefully uh, an idea of what we can do moving forward, guys, okay? So... Um, click support request fill out appropriate fields and submit okay please note that this is still in <laughs> this is still in test mode okay so it's still in test mode right however we hope it will address any issues not yet responded to which is all of the issues because you don't respond to any of the issues in the first place you never respond you never communicate Come on, guys, get it together, all right? Get it together. Let's figure this out, guys. Uh, note, users may only submit one request at a time. Okay, so let me just... Uh, okay, yeah, so I've read the announcement. Click, save and close. Okay, so let me just put this into layman's terms. Let me just let me tell you what this means, guys. Okay, uh, and, and what this means, basically is uh hey you know we're 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 going to uh we're going to continue to ignore your support requests and here's the new reason why so if you have a pending request forget about it they're not going to answer it now you got to put in a new request ticket let's see what these things look like if i can even pull them up now you got to put in a new request ticket okay 
and you've got to put in your first name and your first name, excuse me, your last name, your distributor ID, your email, and then your comments and you have to submit a selfie holding your ID. Okay? Which I mean that's not unheard of. A lot of a lot of people request that, but the the, the thing is with Novatech there's real no really no reason for that. Right? They're just putting in more uh roadblocks in place so that they can justify either completely ignoring your request or being super late on answering it. I, why? Why? I mean, Novatech, why? Why don't you just get a support team? Why don't you just hire some people and get some support and get on top of your tickets? I mean, yeah, sure, you've got a lot of people who are in your company, in your organization. Novatech has exploded, Novatech has blown up, and right before it blew up, it, you know, right after it blew up, I should say, you had this this whole thing happen last year with uh, California and Canada. A lot of people got spooked. A lot of people got scared. A lot of people panicked and tried to withdraw all at once, prompting Novatech to shut down the trading account withdrawals so that nobody can get their money. And they still haven't opened up the trading account withdrawals. What they have been trying to do is they've been trying to get caught up on the bonus account payouts, right? So they're trying to get caught up on that. Uh, as far as I've heard, they are getting caught up. But from what I'm hearing in the comments from you guys is they're still uh, they're still behind in, in some areas. Some of you guys have still not gotten your uh, requests for your bonus account withdrawals. It is now the 13th of March, so hopefully they'll get those caught up by the end of March, and then they'll be able to honor what they said they were going to do, which is what they said they were going to do is open up the trading accounts again uh, at the beginning of April, the trading account withdrawals. All right, so... We're just, we're just, you know, time is going to tell on that one, guys. We're going to have to see what happens there. Hopefully, they are able to to, to get that together. Uh, but we know, and what I've said on this channel, what I've told you guys a million times, is that you're not really going to get good support at Novatech. Now, hopefully, hopefully one day I can come on here and make a new video and say, hey, it seems like the support tickets are working. It looks like they hired some staff. And it looks like they're getting their, their, their game where it needs to be in terms of support. Look. Yes, your company grew a lot, okay? Your company grew fast. It uh, it got on the radar of a lot of people. And yeah, you've got some problems and you've got to deal with those problems, right? You've got to come up with a solution and you do need to hire some support staff. You're not going to be able to, to like, you're not going to be able to, to, to handle a million support tickets if you just got two or three people working at the company, okay? Come on. Come on. Right, so we all should know that by now. Uh, in terms of that, guys, uh, what else? What else? What else? Okay, my uh, bonus account is doing fine. Uh, all of my payouts have come in. My trading account rollover has happened. Uh, I didn't have any trouble logging into the website today. The, lo the website lo logged in right away. No problems there. Uh, and it looks like everything is, is going smoothly in terms of the actual software in the back office, okay? So what needs to, like I said, what needs to get caught up is they have to get the bonus account payments caught up. And then we got to see what they do with these trading accounts. So, you know, time is going to tell on that. And that has been a quick update on Novatech for you guys as to what's going on. Throw your comments in the description. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also hit the notification bell. We'll see you guys on the next one. Take care, guys.